on the second green, fixing a new drainage problem. During the project, we had some tractors that drove over our original uh, clay drainage tile. They got crushed. Didn't know that until we started getting all the rain that came through. Water backed up, started bubbling up, and we had some big soft areas in here. Thank you to a handful of the members that let us know. Uh, we did see it as well, um, but wanted to let you know that we're fixing this. Year to date, we're at nine and a half inches of rain, which has been great. It's leached the salts, which is the most important thing for us. The other side of things, uh, we've started to see a lot of earthworm castings come up. And in the new sod areas where we're holding a little too much moisture, we've seen a little bit of disease. All of it's okay, we're fine, we're gonna grow through it. Um, another side effect to the rain is that, as you all know, we've had no carts out here the entire month of January. Thank you for your patience and understanding. We make these decisions for the long-term benefit of the golf course. We're on the back tees of 15 and 18. And in the distance here, you can see that they're starting to set up for Hogue. They're gonna make some noise. Uh, we ask them to be quiet and try and be as respectful as possible to the golfers. Uh, but what I wanted to share about these back tees, in the next couple of weeks, we're gonna start shutting down the back tees so that they can recover in time for the tournament in mid-March.